We have hosted exchange students from Japan, China, Reunion Island and Hong Kong for about 15 years and they've been male and female and ranging from the ages of 10 to 18. We've only hosted two Hobsea students, uh, both from Japan, both boys. Uh, one was 15 and one was 16 this year and last year. Our daily routine for when we have international students is they'd go to school and after they go home from school we'd pick them up and we'd either go out with them somewhere like to the beach or we'd go for a walk or we own quite a couple of animals so we'll spend time with them outside. My homestay student would walk to school with me and walk home from school with me that night and then we would go home, take the dog out for a walk together and then we would go watch some Australian cartoons or play some pool. On the weekends that we have them with, we would either go away with them to like the Coorong or we'd go to Granite Island or take them swagging or just have a general experience of going to the city some nights or the beach. We took them shopping, we took them to Marion, um, we, took, uh, we took one to Mount Lofty. Um, we also took them to the Happy Valley Reservoir and they saw the kangaroos which was really fun and we've seen like koalas and like Australian wildlife for them to take photos of. I've learned many things from our international students um, ranging from the culture that they live in and how polite they can be to the different types of food they eat. I've learnt a little bit of Japanese from staying with them. Um, they've taught me some um, words and ways to talk to them. Um, also learned more about their culture and how things differ in um, their country to my country.